Hello, everyone. This is Nathan Bridges from Nathan's Nuggets and Tam with Mike Edwards, Georgia Southern Commit. Thanks for joining me today. No problem. Thanks for having me. No problem. I'll start the first question. How old were you when you started playing football? I was about seven years old when I first started playing. Did you start young? Yeah, I started young. I had to – uh, at first I didn't want to play, but then I saw my friends playing, so I decided to play with them. Oh, really? At first you didn't want to play? Yeah, I didn't want to play at first. It was too much contact for me at first. <laughs> That's funny. Good thing you decided to play, though. Yeah. Did you play any other sports? Uh, I had played basketball when I was – I played basketball when I was, like, three, and I always played up. So I've been playing basketball for the longest. I stopped two years ago. Oh, so basketball was your first sport? Yeah. What was your first season doing varsity football like? Uh, my first season, it was – I kind of say it wasn't hard, but it was it was different, though, because I went from inside linebacker to outside linebacker. So, it, but it was cool, though. So, you went – you moved to outside linebacker your first season doing varsity? Yeah. Was that, like, a hard adjustment or not too bad? It wasn't too bad. Because it was, like, easier for the read from the outside than from the inside. So, it, it was easier to move it, actually. Oh, so it's, like, it was easier to do? Yeah. What was it like playing for the Hewitt Trustville football program? Uh, it was fun. The coaches, they all cool. You have fun with it, laugh and joke with all the coaches, players. We was all together, mostly. So, you guys, you got to, like, have fun also, like, with the coaches and everything? Yeah, like we would play four square in the locker rooms. Coaches would come join sometime. Oh, really? That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> I know you just finished the season, had a tough loss to Thompson, but how would you say the season went for you overall? Overall, I feel like it was a good season. I feel like we could have finished better, but it was good overall. Everybody played their best, I believe. So everyone played up to their best, and overall it was pretty good? Yeah. What were your emotions while you were playing your last high school game? At the beginning, I was excited. I felt like we was going to win. I didn't feel like it was going to be the last, so I was excited at the beginning. But then as it went on and towards the end, I was a little sad because most, pe most of the people on the team I probably ain't going to see no more. We all, was, we all good friends, but I, I know I ain't going to see most of them no more after this year. It was kind of sad because like that was your last time – probably playing on the same field as them, too. Yeah. What do you feel your biggest strengths are on the field? On the field, I said my biggest strength is uh, play recognition. And, uh, yeah, basic play, play recognition. Like, when they, I could tell when the quarterback's finna throw the dig route or he finna throw the shallow route, all that, or if it's a run or a pass. So you're able to recognize the play and what the quarterback's trying to do? Yeah. That's a good ability. What made you pick Georgia Southern? Uh, the coaches, they was always talking to me, checking up on me, checking up on me and my family. So I felt like it was all like a family there. So I decided to join. So they were always like checking up on you and like making sure you were doing well. Yeah. When Georgia Southern offered you, were they always your favorite? Uh, yeah, that was one of my one of my favorites when they offered me. Yeah. So you liked them from the start when they offered? Yeah, because like right before they offered, they was talking to me a whole lot before they offered, and then after they offered, they still was talking to me. Oh, really? That's good. So they were, like, they kind of made connections with you even before they offered you? Yeah. How would you say the recruiting process was for you overall? Oh, it was It was weird, mostly, because of the uh, corona, but other than that, it was good. So it was kind of weird, like, with the COVID stuff, how you can't visit? Yeah. When are you going to visit Georgia Southern? Hopefully during the fall, but right now it's a dead period, so I don't know for real if I'll be able to visit. I probably, if I visit, it's probably going to be me just going to the school after I graduate. I heard about the dead period. Like, you can't talk to the coaches when you visit. Yeah. Are you able to go to a game? Uh, yeah, but I had to like 
I have to like go buy the ticket myself and go. Like, I can get one from the coaches. So they can't give you a ticket. You'd have to like get it yourself and then get there. Yeah. What do you think the jump from high school to college will be like? I feel like it's gonna be different. It's gonna be more comp- more competition because everybody's more than likely gonna be on the same level. So I have to step my game up, put extra work in. It's like every like the best of the best competing against each other. Yeah. And the game will probably be like a lot faster. Yeah, it's gonna be way faster. Now that the season is over, what are you going to do to prepare to be ready at the college level? Uh, I've been working with my trainer uh, still. I'm going to be working with him all the whole off season until I head off to college. See, that's good. You've been working with your trainer. And you're going to keep working with him until you go to Georgia Southern? Yeah. Was there any certain team that when you always played them, you got the most typed up for? Uh, I'd say probably Thompson. I, I like to play Thompson because they had good players. It was like evenly matched game each time. Always, sorry. Sorry, what were you going to say? I will say it was always like evenly matched with players. So it was always like good – like talented players playing against each other. Yeah. What was the best game you had in your high school career? My guess game, my best game would be probably Thompson last year. I had a whole bunch of highlights that game. That's the oh, year really? we won. Yeah. That's cool. So you won that game. Yeah, we won that game. Was it at home or away? At home. That's good. Always good to get the one, and you get to do it in front of the like, fans. Yeah. Do you guys get fans this year? Uh, yeah, we had fans come. It wasn't a whole bunch compared to the other years because of the COVID, but it was still a good good amount. That's good that you got some at least. Yeah. And you guys got to play a full season, right? Yeah, we did. What was your favorite high school moment? Uh, my favorite moment, probably, probably yeah, we uh beat Thompson really, like two years ago. It's probably yeah, that's probably my favorite, favorite uh, cause they had one state yeah, so it felt good beating them. So Thompson's like your biggest rival. Yeah, yeah. You said like, it felt really good to be able to beat them. Yeah, it did. What are you most looking forward to at Georgia Southern? Uh, basically becoming a, better as a player and as a man and hopefully go to the NFL draft from there. So to like, become a better player and a, per- a man, I – everything and then get to the NFL. Yeah. I think you can do it. I think I can. How do you think your play style fits in at Georgia Southern? Uh, Well, when I watch the games, I see that they let their linebackers flow. And I do better when I just flow around with the ball instead of just being staggered. So I feel like that helped me out. That's good. So you're better when you flow? Yeah. Is that what you did in high, high school? Yeah, basically, I just flowed around and filled in the spots. So that's good that it, like, similar to what you did in high school. Yeah. Who was your favorite football player as a kid? As a kid, uh, as a kid, my favorite football player was Ray Lewis. He was good for the Ravens. Yeah, he was. He's a hard hitter, too. Yeah, he was a really hard hitter. Do you try to model your game after anyone? Uh, I try to model mine after Isaiah Simmons. He's really good for the Cardinals now. Yeah, yeah. I like him. And mm-hmm, then he played for – he was good at Clemson too. Yeah. Everybody said I played just like him, so I'm like – Oh, really? That's cool. 
Yeah. How would you describe yourself off the field? Off the field, I just try. I I'm like a funny, chill dude. I could joke around with anybody, have fun. So you're funny. You got, you can joke around with anyone and just have fun. Yeah. Then the last question I have is for fun. You get to take any three NFL players to dinner. They can be past or present. Who are you taking? Uh, Isaiah Simmons, Mike Vick. No, no, no. Isaiah Simmons, Lamar Jackson, and uh, Ray Lewis. Those are all good players. They'd be fun dinners. Yeah. The one with Lamar would be cool. Yeah, it really would be. Okay. And the Isaiah Simmons one is cool because since people say you play like him, that'd be cool to talk to him. Yeah, get some pointers from him too. Mm-hmm. And Ray Lewis, he's a Hall of Famer. Yeah, that's true. All right, thanks for joining me today. Those are all the questions I have. Thanks for having me. No problem.